mess you made. Back there at Lock Marine. I think we're in for rain. Oi, Mocha! And remember, never venture into the bits alone. Always take a pop. You heard. Get in on me. Greetings. Don't know you. Not letting you in. And don't you fucking stand there. Sure we can't work this out? How's that? I pay you, you let me in. Uh, give it here. Get in. And remember, we've an eye on you. Who runs the fights? Igor. Come on, get ready. Your turn now. I am Stop ready. Stop staring, uh, you'll jinx our work. Losers get paid anything. <laughs> losers get caught. Number off deal, I hope. I switched the sword for all that. You need to hold on for a moment. I'll <clears> hold on all right. <clears throat> Ooh. There's your coin. That's it. We'll feed on more. No Take grand it while I'm giving it. Stay. Delete this city somehow. I need work. What can you do? Good with a sword. Wouldn't scoff at working as protection. And who here would you protect? Crowds can spin out of control. Somebody's gotta keep the peace. Mm hmm. Claim any kind of experience. I'm a witcher. I kill monsters for coin. Been doing it all my life. Humans won't be a problem. A guard must fight sometimes, but that's not most important. The essential question is, can you control yourself? And can you control a crowd? Been taught how to slow down or speed up my heart rate, how to dilate my pupils and alter my metabolism. My medallion vibrates when danger's near, and I know a few simple spells. Hmm, I'll have to test you. I want to see how you manage in a fight, if you can fight at all. You shall fight in the arena. Survive three bouts, and I'll put you to work. Set me up. Already have. Shall we start right away, or do you need time to prepare? Always prepared. Excellent. Let's see what you're worth. Remember, you fight to the death. The crowd doesn't take kindly to those who spare their foes. Let's do this. Ready your purses! Betting is open! From the Far East, where a man's life is worth less than a cup of water, our witcher, a murderous mutant, his opponent, Gustav Rohn, a man who cut his way out of his mother's womb with a knife, as ever, a fight to the death! The Witcher wins! Next fight! Born brawlers in battle! A fracas! A rumpus! A fray! The Witcher versus the Hairy Brothers! Straight from the Wild Isles of Stelliga! Sired by a mountain bear! They live to kill! The Witcher wins again! Next fight! The Witcher doing what he does best! Face to face with beasts!
Tell me a true bruise had come to the arena. Would you believe it? They were right. Thanks. Cyprian Wiley, known the most as Horse and Junior, appreciates good handiwork. Well, we've not had enough. Now, Cleaver's dwarves are in the sewers. They've slaughtered the guards. Don't stand there like a sodden prick at a wedding. Master the men and get out those magics! And would someone please kill the blasted witcher? You heard the man, kill him! this wall.
Here. Same reason anyone comes here. Play a bit, have a good time. Invite only, mate. Shit out of luck. Here's my invite. All yours if you want it. Yeah, gladly take it. Incidentally, bloody useless, these crowds. In Tamaria, you could say, you met my friend Fontest. Down in Nilfgaard, it'd be Emperor would like to vouch for me. With this shite, nothing. That's true. What we got here? Hey, some fucking ship. Ship couldn't vouch for you. What are you gonna say? Meet my friend this ship. Bloody barmy. Damn right stupid. Why right, you can go in. Cards lining up today. A mutant? What the hell's a witcher doing here? See any drowned dead? Or other shit sits around here? Nope, no monsters. Great opportunity to play some cards. Clever man, eh? All right, we'll play, provided you've coin. I do. This time, they've got the best powder in the city right here. Just want to play. If you insist. I believe I will plow your ass like a cheap horse. I'll not play you anymore. Bad luck. Go ruin someone else. Look on the bright side. Unlucky at cards, lucky in love. Mm. And you been getting. Mm. Cards being kind today? Matters little. I don't play plebs. Actually, I was knighted. Ahem. Indeed. Not to pry, good sir, but who bestowed the accolade? Meave, Queen of Lyria and Rivia, during the Second War. Skirmish broke out on a bridge. Happened to be there with friends. We drove the Nilfgaardians back. Then Queen Meave told me to kneel, recite an oath. The battle for the bridge? Oh yes, heard of that. Ahem. Consider my objections withdrawn, sir. Wanna play? Naturally. Good luck to you. <clears throat> Congratulations on your victory. Thanks. Getting good hands. Luck of the draw today. You might make better use of that luck then. We've a room for specially selected upstairs. Really big stakes there. If that's the case, I accept the invitation. Come with me. Private room for the chosen few. No one will disturb you here. Doesn't look too cozy. Not a comfortable place to play cards. Someone less trusting might take it for an interrogation room. 
Junior doesn't believe in miracles. This is where cheats learn just how much he dislikes being robbed. Work him over. Once you're done, wrap a nice thick chain around his legs and drop him in the pontar. Take him from the back! Ah. Is he? Hey, can you hear me? You alive? Don't finish me. Don't intend to. Shit, those... Cocksuckers got me good. Bones are intact. Will you free me? You're not hurt all that bad. Let's talk first. Why are you here? Uh, what's it look like? I came here to sit and think. God. All right. Clever and tough's not working for me. They took me for one of Bedlam's moles. Are you? Well, kinda, yeah. So what have you kinda learned? Horson's working hand in glove with the Redanians. I don't know the details, but he's on their side. And that's all I know. Don't trust you an inch. Told you all I know, I, I swear. You'll have to stay a bit longer. No, please. Think about it, it's not too late, hear me? Change your mind. Don't trust you and it. Told you. No. Change your mind. Take care of yourself. Thanks. I'll lay low until things settle down. Bedlam will learn you help me. See ya. Be sure to reward you.
We crossed the Yara, we uh. crossed the Ponta as well. Uh. Nothing interesting here. To burn the corpses, though. Else rats will congregate to feast. Or if I hired a witch. Greetings. Ah, you're Reuven's mate, aren't you? Heard of you. You in charge here? What's it to you? Looking for Junior. Aha! Welcome to the Horse and Hunters Club. Alas, we're fresh out of membership cards. And you're out of luck as far as Junior goes. Bugger's not here. Know where I can find him? No. Bloody mess. Just sort of happened. Came here, polite and all, to invite Horson Junior to a get-together with his mates. Became obvious right quick that none here acknowledged the ancient rite of hospitality. I'm gonna take a look around. Got my eye on you. Seems to me I've heard of you before, Whitehair. Dwarves were thorough as debt collectors. Didn't leave a scrap. has been scrubbed clean.
If this is reliable information, Orson's neck deep in shit. Source seems reliable. Hmm. It would certainly explain how he had the nerve to break with the Big Four. Need someone who can get me in to see Junior. You must still have some contacts among the Redanians? I don't, but you do. Enlighten me. Temerian, former commander of the Blue Stripes. Ring a bell? Vernon Roach. He's holed up with his men in a camp near Oxenford. Pay him a visit. You're sure to cheer him up at least. Not a headache. Show me what. So long. Top notch. Show me. Looking for Roach. No one here by that name. Anything else? I see. And behind you, that's a berry picker's camp? We're, uh, bird watchers. Let me guess. 
That sword's in case you run into a hornbill. No. Hornbills aren't endemic to this area. Don't migrate here either. You blind, Hortensio! That's Geralt, old friend of mine. Come in, Geralt. Geralt of Rivia, safe and sound. Vernon Roach, Tamaria's last hope. Laugh all you want. Tamaria will rise again. Roach, I cannot abandon them. I you can and must, because those are your orders. They'll die, please. We're done. Dismissed. What do you do here, Hunt Squirtel? You jest, right? Who cares about the Squirtel anymore? To marry it. That's what matters. How do you wind up here? Came with the army, of course. Its remnants. When Nilfgaard crossed the Yoruga, I dropped everything. Threw it all away to hell and rode for the front to fight the invader. Joined the second Temerian army under John Natalis. We were to stop the Black One's advance along the dull Blathana Mount Carbon line. And we did. For three days. Then they smashed us into splinters. Soon after, I heard Radovid was assembling his forces near Novigrad. That he'd promised to fight for a free north. Broke through with the remains of Natalis' army, but... But? But Radovid proved no better than Amir. So I decided I would mount my own fight. Looking for Horson Jr. I've heard of him. Though I'm not sure why you think he might be in my camp. Heard some birds chirping. You've got some of the same friends. Both seem to count Radovid among your allies. These birds. They're terribly talkative. I'll need to see them. You'll have to point them out. Mm -hmm. Meantime, Vernon. Willing to help or do I need to keep looking? Hmm. As always, you've more luck than you deserve. I'm on my way to meet my Redanian contact. We're meeting near Oxenfurt, at a chess club. Thanks. Knew I could count on you. Oi, clumsy ass. Now, which... They can't catch the pox, in that right? It's true you killed two. You and our commander.
Come on. Ready? My contact awaits at the chess club. Let's get this over with. Your contact? Who is it? Slippery little bugger. I'd have nothing to do with him. Were the circumstances any different? You mean you don't trust him? I trust no one. Including you. Come on. Something's not right. Let's see what. Checkmate. They say it's the game of kings. That chess teaches one to think strategically. What a load of rubbish. Both sides have identical pieces. The rules stay invariably the same. How does this mirror real life? Witcher. Do you know why I play chess? For practice? To hone your thinking? No. I play chess to reveal the game's secret. Blood thumps inside these chessmen. You need only listen, and you will hear. Dub dub. Dub dub. Dub dub. A heart pumping with life. <laughs> I take a pawn, and I hear flesh being rent. I win a piece, and I hear screams from the depths of its bowels. I want to break the chessmen open. Squeeze the truth from them. Do you see what I mean? Yes, sire. Believe I do. You know shit. You're merely humoring me. I was not speaking literally. First hidden truth. A monarch is always surrounded by fools. Understand? I think I do now. Unimportant. Let us speak. Why have you brought the Witcher here? I think he'd best explain. Expected a Redanian spy. Had no idea we'd be meeting a king. When you've an opportunity to emit intermediaries, I'd suggest you avail yourself of it. I'm looking for Cyprian Wiley, Orson Jr. I know Redania supports him. Why do you seek him? It's personal. Fair enough. I'll not pry. I have placed Junior in a mansion in Oxenfurt. Very few know this. They'll not let you in unannounced. Thus, you must tell them you've come about the new whores. Junior constantly requests fresh women. I hear he doesn't treat them well. You just give me a man after investing coin and time in him? Can't help but wonder why. 
Consider it a gesture of goodwill. Almost. I'll expect you to return the favor. And also, Junior has lost his purpose. The Big Four is no more. I shall contact you to collect in due course. Now go. And you, Roach. We must speak another time. Radovid's sinking ever deeper into madness as I see it. I know where to find Junior. Don't really care beyond that. Geralt, come to think of it, I too wanted to ask a favor. I have a terrible problem with Vess. Need someone to talk some sense into her. Come see me at the camp. I'll tell you more. Let me think about it. See you, Roach. Another day gone to shit. Horson Jr. Oh, this one's got bollocks, don't it? Junior ought to know someone sniffing around. Here to talk about the new girls for Horson. Never seen you here before. You know him. Can't say that I do. I'm new here. Yeah? What happened to Norbert? Cleaver happened to him. Poor sod. Better than to die of consumption, remember? He looked a bit on the down slope. All right. But next time, remember to bring the tarks for Junior through the back by way of the old canal. Go through there. Thanks. I'll keep it in mind. <clears throat> what do you want? Where's Horse and Junior? Oh, this one's got Junior. Wanna see Junior? Chat, chat. You people, honestly. Got nerve coming to the front door. You're brazen. It ain't right. And we aren't stupid. Honest. Tell him. No, we're not. Let's gut the bastard.
much you challenge me. I'm it. Come on, come closer. Keep me together, Lex. Fucking degenerate. He so much as touched Siri, he'll pay. What the sandwich fuck is this? No! Fuck me! Help! 
me for fuck's sake! No one's coming. Junior, I've come to talk. I'll do whatever you want. Got a few questions to start with. I'll, I'll tell you everything. I'm looking for a young woman and a minstrel. I know you've met them. A bird? What fucking... Oh! Ashen-haired with a sword on her back, just like me. Yeah, yeah. Uh, that was... I, I, I remember. Pay attention now. You'll tell the truth. Wanna know why? I won't lie. Honest. Took me a long time to find you. Wasn't an easy road to travel. I'm angry and tired. Had to talk to people I didn't want to talk to. Wouldn't normally talk to. Some of them tried to cheat me. Some tried to lie. I didn't like it one bit. I feel like one more lie'd be the last bitter drop in a chalice full of sorrow. And then, then I'd do something I would later regret. Now you know why you can't lie to me? Yes. Good. I'd like to know how the ashen-haired woman ended up meeting you, and what happened to her. What happened to her? She attacked me! Lie one more time, and I'll cut your balls off. <laughs> We've made a deal. I was to repair their magic filler, what's it? That girl and the songster were to bring me Siggy Ruvin's treasure. They didn't, so I might have flown off the handle a bit, I admit. What did you do? I nabbed their flunky, Dodo, and waited for them to come for him. Look, this. Here's what they wanted fixed. A phylactery? You can fix something like this? Not me. I know a guy. Wasting my time, Junior. I need details. I'll tell you, tell you all! Just the way it happened. Got a bad feeling about this. Calm down, Dandelion. I can't leave Doo Doo in Horse and Junior's hands, you know that. I know, I know, but my gut can't be reasoned with, and no amount of sympathy I feel can silence it, blot it out. Cheer up. We can manage this, I'm certain. Famous last words right there. Have you learned where Horson is keeping Doo Doo? Room on the top floor. One with the balcony. I'll need to cross onto the roof. Wait for me in front of Junior's house. And I know it's difficult, but do try to look inconspicuous. If they... If they hurt you, Horson will pay. I must climb onto the roof. There's the balcony. Let's see what's inside. And now, my dear Dodo, 
I believe I'll try a different tool. Afraid I'm bored with this one. You're fucking balmy, Junior! Anyone tell you that? No. Most say I'm nice. Wants to get to know me. So you enjoy good company? Like to make new acquaintances? <laughs> you plan to introduce me to someone interesting? There you are. Good of you to come. I've been waiting for you. On your knees, bitch. Where's Ruvid's treasure? Yeah. I'll get you, you little whore. Where's Ruvid's treasure? An eye for an eye. Listen, this is what we'll do. Get that fucking whore! Told you true. Dudu, what happened to him? I don't fucking know. Prick vanished. There one moment, gone the next. What happened to the woman? Fuck if I know. One of the boys got her in the back, but she's alive, I swear it. Got anything else to say? I told you all I know. Everything. You hurt the woman I'm looking for. You tortured her friend. She attacked me. I have a right to defend myself. I beg you. Got what I deserved. Have mercy. Please. Let me tell you where things stand. I'm looking for this woman, because she's like a daughter to me. And that's why I just can't let this go. No, no.
Seems you've resolved your matters. It's time you return the favor. Radovid doesn't like to wait much, does he? No, he does not. You'll come with us. The HMS Oxenford Tretagore. Once the crown jewel of the Redanian fleet. Decommissioned now, though. Nice boat. You'll need to leave your weapons if I'm to let you aboard. Follow me. The ship was funded with donations from noble women. Ladies from the most prominent families gave up their jewelry. A spur of the moment patriotic impulse. You're a homeless wanderer. Can't understand what it is to truly love one's country. There you are. Need something from me, Your Majesty? You've never been one to mince words. Very well. Find Philippa Eilhart. That's my wish. I ordered her eyes gouged out once. But apparently her blindness troubles her not. My hunters have detected Lady Eilhart hiding east of Oxenfurt. They have further established that she has magically sealed the entrance to her shelter. Entering it will be difficult. I believe you might succeed in doing so. Bring her to me, alive. Philippa Eilhart? What's she looking for here? I suspect she wants to find her old friends, reconvene the Lodge. Perhaps she seeks revenge on me. Lady Eilhart is known for her persistence. At times I recall the lessons she gave me when I was a child. Her teachings as memorable as the punishment she meted out. She was subtle and patient in her cruelty. I took her sight, but she remains dangerous. I'd advise you to be cautious. Need to think about it. Don't take too long. We wouldn't want Philippa to escape. Again. You may go. Your arms. Thanks. Never seen better steel in my life. Blade must strike true, no? It's a matter of the hand, not the steel it's holding. 